So the first step in building your fig rig is measuring out your lengths of pipe. Now I have two different sets of pipes here. The first one is the diameter of the fig rig and the second one is the circumference. Now the diameter is the point of reference with your whole rig. So if this is 50 centimeters, then this will affect the size of your circumference. I have chosen 60 centimeters just so it ergonomically fits my preference. Uh, so I have, what I've done is I've measured out 60 centimeters and cut the length of pipe. Once you have cut this length of pipe, then you do the calculations for the circumference, which is uh, your diameter times pi, which equals whatever. So what I've done is I've got 60 centimeters of pipe, so I've got to times that by pi, which gives me an answer of 183. So I've cut a length of pipe that is 183 centimeters. So what I have to do for this fig rig, I will need to chop this circumference in half to make it two semicircles. So what I need to do is I need to measure out the length of the rig, find the halfway point, which is there, and mark it. Once you have marked it, now you need to cut it in half. The best solution is a pipe cutter. If not, you can go second best and actually cut it with a saw. If not, then just find your own means of cutting it. So I've got my line all around the pipe, so I'll need to cut that now. So now I have two sets of pipe which will be my circumference and one pipe that will be my diameter. So the next step now is actually bending the pipe. So now we are on to bending our pipe. So I have got my bending spring here and I will insert it into one end of the pipe and I will start bending. Now I'm going to choose a specific spot and start um, and start heating up this particular spot. Heat it up just so it's manual. Once you have heated up the pipe to your preference, I guess, uh, then it's time to start bending. Now you want to keep the same angle throughout the entire pipe. It is going to be quite slow at the start, but as soon as we get down the pipe, it will start becoming bigger and more of a curve. So then again, we start on a different spot and keep heating it up. And just This, this music 
is like great ambience music. So one last thing before we wrap up is I really need to address something. Um, this happening right now, me being here with this black thing and you seeing my face, um, is because I made a boo-boo. Uh, when I was filming, the capacity on the smartphone that I was using maxed out and it cut off. So I actually did the whole assembly thing and spray painting thing without filming so yeah so yeah and I cannot I do not have the time nor the resources to redo that um, as you can see I am in my house uh, dinner's ready I, I I'm living my life but I have come here to address this to you because when you heat PVC pipe the molecules in the PVC, whatever, um, are extremely dangerous, like toxic. So, I really advise you to wear a face mask and to operate in a well-ventilated area when you are bending these pipes. Um, yes. Now, in the description below, there will be a description on how to assemble these rigs that I completely and utterly didn't take into consideration on me not filming them seeing that it took an hour to make this rig and I am not lying it took one hour to make this rig um, and I forgot that my f iPhone was filming for 25 minutes of that um, so I'll give you a brief description you've got five parts left you've got the crossbar you've got the two t-joints and you've got the two semicircles now with the crossbar you uh, put the t-joints on either end with the singular side like poking into the whole thing whatever um, and then on then you have a crossbar with it, it, it looked like a weird eye like you know those capital eyes yeah it looked like one of them um, just on a weird scale and then you get your two semicircles and you just put the two semicircles into the two vacant slots on either side and you're done. Obviously I'm not good at speaking this and directly communicating to you guys but uh, the link is, well not the link, the description is in the description. So check it out if you want, if you didn't understand my words in English. Yes. See you in the next video.